afternoon, book lovers of the internet. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe because for every subscriber, I get a new subscriber and they also finish reading a book of my choice or read a page from a book of my choice. So, in today's video, I am going to be reviewing Gravity Falls Journal 3 by Alex Hirsch. This one has 288 pages and I rated it 5 stars out of 5, of course. And I read it in preparation of almost re receiving and, um, yeah, the publication of the Book of Bill by the same author, 10 years after the show has finished. So, um, yeah, this was my third time reading this, so it was very fun to revisit one of my favorite franchises of all time. It is still very entertaining and nostalgic and also quite goofy. I really enjoyed experiencing the show in book form for the third time and only decided to give this a reread in preparation of the release of the Book of Bill which I pre-ordered from Waterstones a couple of days ago and I was informed that it was dispatched um, about two days ago now so it should be in my hands right on time on the 24th of July so yes yeah, Stanford and Stanley who are the Grunkle twins I suppose uh, they both live rather tragic lives when you take a closer look. Um, however, towards the end, amends are made, all the appropriate amends are made, and everyone and everything finishes happily ever after, except for maybe Bill and all his cronies. So, yeah, I mean, excluding, of course, the lie that is also see you next summer. Um, that is also not factual, not true, and quite disappointing that we never got a third season of Gravity Falls which is something that I certainly look forward to, even though I think it is one of the best pieces of fiction of all time. And yeah, I do kind of think that a third season might spoil Gravity Falls, so I hope that my hype, um, that my expectations aren't too high for the Book of Bill, because I don't want it to ruin my excitement for Gravity Falls, though I doubt it will, because Alex Hirsch has a brilliant mind, and all the puns remind me of either Bo Burnham, for example, or Daniel Dean Kingswell, who is a brilliant Maltese YouTuber. Um, yeah, the connections their brains make, they're so fascinating, and the wordplay is always so exciting. The creativity, the imagination, the immersion, the concept of immersion in this one is very, very heavy. So much attention is paid to the details, so that there are very little plot holes. So, yeah, that is something which I also very much appreciate. Um, I am also surprised with regard to how long it takes Dipper to understand certain contexts in this show, since the journal is filled with details about anything and everything, including where the other journals might be buried. And this journal itself got me thinking that Dipper might be a very, very slow reader, uh, since if this was mine, right, I would probably finish it the day I found it to completely understand what is going on in Gravity Falls and stop asking questions which have already been answered. I mean, Stanford doesn't only speculate in his journal, he does give some definitive answers which Dipper might have needed. And yeah, if he had read it quicker, he would have been able to solve the mysteries much quicker and he wouldn't have been in so much danger. But do let me know what you think of this in the comment section. So I made three shorts about this book as well, which I will be linking somewhere. And there is a fourth on the way, but this is one of my favorite books of all time. Um, the designs, of course, are absolutely brilliant. The attention paid to the detail. Then there is also another edition where there's a monocle and where one is able to see everything that is written with uh, the invisible ink as well and decipher all the codes, that is something I have never been able to do before. So, yeah, I mean, a bigger fan than I am would have probably done this already. So, yeah, I mean, I love Bill Cipher, one of the best antagonists of all time, I would say. And yeah, that is exactly how an antagonist should be, only having destruction on his mind and not dilly-dallying until the hero manages to fix everything, like, as is the case with so many other franchises, so, yeah, I think that is basically what I have to say. All I have to say about the book, I mean, my favorite character is probably Stanford and Zeus, uh, but I, I love all of them, honestly. 
Mabel is also a fantastic character. We see several perspectives, uh, not just the Dippers or Stanfords. We also have some pages written by Mabel, one by Zeus as well. And yeah, basically there is a summary of every single episode. And it's all in book form, all about Dipper's discoveries, all about his experiences, including the 30 years that Stanford spent away from the rest of his family because of what Stanley did to him. So yeah, I do hope that you buy this book, read it, and let me know what you think. I mean, it's one which I highly recommend. It was a relatively quick read. And one thing I wanted to mention is, look at how brilliant the dust jacket is. Right? We get all the designs, all the blueprints necessary for us to understand what Fiddleford McGucket uh, creates in the show. And I don't think I have another book which is like this, so I do hope that the Book of Bill is at least slightly similar to this. But yeah, that is all I have to say about Gravity Falls Journal 3. Let me know what you think of it in the comment section. Let me know if I missed out on anything or if there is anything interesting you know about Gravity Falls which I might not know already. I am always trying to learn more about Gravity Falls. I watched the show several times, both seasons. I read this one three times now and I look forward to the book of Bill. I also have a Bill Cipher pin which a friend of mine gave me and I am making my love for Gravity Falls known wherever I can go. So Alex Hirsch, if you are watching this, leave a comment. It can be anything just a hi just a thank you for the support and i would appreciate it very very much but yeah thank you to everybody who watched today make sure to like comment share subscribe take a look at my other content and i hope to see you in the next one very very soon bye guys